Hello, Scorpios. So today I am going to be doing your monthly. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to my channel. Please keep in mind that my readings are general and may or may not resonate. Take with us, leave the rest. And also, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. If you need to book a personal with me, I would suggest that you do that. If this resonates with you, my email will be listed in the comment section below. I find that the comment section catches a little people a little bit better. So I'm going to pin it there. Yes, yes, very smart. Okay, very soon. It says, clearly decide what you want so that, ooh, clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. And then your second card out was chemistry. It says there's a strong magnetic attraction here. All right. So you could be dealing with a Libra. I just did their reading and they had the same thing. So if you're dealing with a Libra, you might want to go over there and look at their thing. But I don't know who's toxic here. What's the next and the last card? Unrequited love. Ooh. There is not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. Okay. And deception at the bottom of the deck. Didn't I say, I don't know who the deceptive one is here. Mm. Someone is wearing a, a false mask in this relationship. I don't know. I ain't going to say who, but we'll find out. All right, Spirit, tell me what's going on with Scorpio's love life, please, for September. What the hell is going on here? What the hell is going on between the sheets of my own? This King of Pentacles is looking at things from a different perspective. Could be a Capricorn, Virgo, or Taurus, and this person wants to offer an apology. This literally was in the same place as Libras. Oh my God. And I think they had the hangman too. Yeah, I feel like someone is coming in to offer you something. This person has very deep emotions with you. I feel like they might have kids with you too. But again, this is a stable mother shut your mouth. This person is all about stability. They all about money. They all about making sure shit goes the way it needs to go in a solid way to keep it moving forward. Okay? Um, this person has some love for you. I feel like they're still trying to um, offer it to you. But what is at the bottom of the deck? The Five of Pentacles. This person feels left out in the cold. Or they might have left you out in the cold. Or it could have been vice versa. You guys could have left each other. However, they still here. They still want this. They still have some very deep emotion for you. But something with the ten of swords popping out happened that ended the situation and made them look at things from a different perspective. Okay? So, uh, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, spirit so if you can, please tell me about this very soon with this unrequited love because i mean how soon can something that doesn't really feel the same way about you come in is it does it need to be that fast the tower yes yeah, fast as shit oh someone's hurt here and they're holding it back because of this hurt but they love you yeah, they want, they want you back home. If you're not home or if you are home, then they want you to be home. But this person is just controlling. They're a bit arrogant, so they don't want to come out and tell you everything. But they're hurt by something that happened here. Yeah, but the nine of covers, but they, you still make them very happy. They still want this with you. Okay. So, let's see what the outcome is with this person because something happened something popped off i'm sorry you guys I, you kids might be getting on your nerves too hold on amaya i'm doing readings if you don't get away from my door i didn't ask you that get away from my door If I hear you again, I'm going to pause it. You're going to be in a lot of trouble. Sorry, you guys. What did I just say? Oh, 
Okay. Sorry, you guys. I had half a mind to pause it because she kept going. But, <laughs> trying to give you guys this great reading. Okay, so. Three of Pentacles. Okay, so you guys are going to try to work together. The Hierophant, yeah. Y'all both still want this. The Knight of Pentacles. This person is coming in to offer you some stability. I feel like this is them telling you they want you to come home. Seven of Pentacles, yeah, they want you to work on things. Didn't I tell you that? The Knight of, they're, oh, the Knight of Wands person is rushing in. With some passion, too. Oh, but there's some toxicity here. The tower, the devil. Okay. Okay. This person's doing some bullshit behind your back. Okay. So even if they do come back or they still want passion with you, this person is being a player. There, I said it. Knight of Wands is an in and out energy. The devil is toxic. This person is rushing in and out of people's lives, okay? Yep, the tower, you might find that out. You might have found that out. Could have been you. Whoever it resonates to. Somebody is toxic as fuck and they're a player. DM Gina. Well, that's why it's unrequited then. This person can't wonder why it's not working. It's not working because of this person. Okay. So, Spirit, tell me about money. What's going on with the money? The yang, the coins for my Scorpio. What's going on with my Scorpios? All right, so there's too much conflict. You're too worried about love right now to to move, to deal with money. Okay, but you have to. Okay, that's very important. But I have you too worried about love. Like you might be dealing with two different people or something. But you, yeah, you you can't. You're not really going to be able to get your pockets balanced off. Because you're too worried about what the fuck you want to do here with this death card. You're like, I don't know. Yeah, but with the six of wands here, you're, you'll still push through and get shit done. But it could have been better if you focused more on the finances than this person. Um, if you planned on moving, I'm saying you make that move. Be careful with your arms. At work, at home, wherever. Just be just be careful not to overflex, overdo, over anything. Alright, thank you.